What's up, guys? We're waiting in Starbucks line. Mm. And it's freaking long because obviously it's Black Friday. Oh, look, I got my car mount. I don't know if it works good yet, but we'll see. Took a little hour nap yesterday after we ate, and then we woke up, and then stayed up to like two, and then got back up at seven. Bobby was willing to go earlier, but I don't think so. Seven was early enough for me. Oh my god, guys, look at that line. It just keeps getting longer. I could have just did a slow zoom on my editing software. Venti ice toasted white mocha. Can I get a venti ice white toasted? A toasted white mocha. Toasted white mocha. Made with almond milk. Anything Made with almond milk. Do you sell the whipped cream? Yes. Yes. Okay. That'd be it. I bet they're gonna run out of so much shit today. Probably. Good thing there's a couple of Starbucks out here. Hello. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you. Y'all have a good one. Look at those sprinkles. Come on. She wanna be a true blonde, but she can't because her red keep pulling out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh it's God. a struggle. And but right now your truck matches mine. I know it does. And that's what making me not want to switch it because we literally have everything the same. Chrome and black. The only thing you need is a little bit of orange in here, but I know you ain't doing orange. Um, no, but I'll probably do like hot pink or something. <laughs> neon pink and neon orange. Come on now. We're out here, guys. Bucks have a star. Bodyguard. <laughs> Is it that Victoria's Secret? I don't know. Where is that? Oh, God, that would be awful. I'm so curious, like, not in a mean way, but like, what the hell happened? What are y'all doing? Got a little busy over there. <laughs> well, you know Victoria's Secret is one of the busiest places on Black Friday. Where are you going? Uh, Urban Outfitters? Like, yeah, that's right, that's right here. Go to Urban and then go to where the, the workout place you were talking about. Lulu. Yeah. Lulu Limon. <laughs> People are acting fucking dumb out here today, you guys. How many people cut us off? How many people ran stop signs to try to get in front of us? <laughs> it's been insane. And let them see a parking spot. They'll act like it's the last one on earth. <laughs> So much taller than me, I have to change the whole <laughs> camera angle. Oh, that blanket. Or whatever that is, that's not a blanket. Right here? Yep. Holy twat. Yeah, you gotta go up and over. And you're back in. Oh. Well. You know, buy three, get three. 
Look at this fucking crowd behind me. That's for Airy. The three most popular stores on Black Friday are Airy, Bath and Body, and Victoria's Secret or Pink. What's up, guys? Wait, this is not my main channel. Okay, let, let me put on my second channel voice. What's up, guys? It's the same voice. Okay, so obviously, I think I put the footage of a Black Friday shopping at the beginning of this. And now we're into the haul. Now, some of the stuff I did order. Um, and then I also went in person. But I just combined my orders from um, the holiday sale at Sephora and Ulta. And I just put them in my bags from when I shopped in the store. It's the same damn sale. I just shopped online and in store. Both. So, most of the stuff I'm going to show you is everything I bought. Um beauty home type stuff i do have one outfit one workout outfit that i'm going to show you but if i would have brought all the clothes that i bought too this video would be way too long i'm just going to show you the one because i did order from buff bunny from her sale and it was it's just a hoodie and shorts i'm still going to show it um otherwise clothing i got american eagle airy gymshark like it would be a lot. So we're just gonna do the main stuff right here. This is Black Friday sale, holiday haul, whatever you wanna call it. Let's get started. The first thing, the smallest package I have, <laughs> I already opened the conditioner because I wanted to smell it, but I got the Brad Mondo X Mondo Hair Blonde Shampoo and Conditioner because apparently his is very good for blonde hair and everybody said the smell is really good which it is i can't use products that don't smell good so that sold me and they do and also i'm about to go platinum so i really needed some good look i mean look at this freaking color that ugh. and it just smells like luxury i don't know how to explain how it smells but it smells really good okay anyway i got the shampoo and conditioner and then i got his viper smoothing oil which i've heard a lot about oh it's actually gonna focus oh yeah i fixed my focus so yeah viper smoothing oil slither and smooth out your hair with an injection of viper smoothing oil i don't know i saw someone talk about it they said it was really good and they loved it and it smelled good and it does smell good and that's what i care about let's do sephora sephora is on the top oh i actually didn't separate sephora okay let's start with the in-store first thing i got was this this is i believe this is huda beauty's um fragrance line k ali or ali i'm assuming ali really pretty i i like vanilla sweet luxury type scents but i didn't i i couldn't find the big bottles of this in store and i didn't want to buy a um big one online without knowing how it smelled so i did buy this one in store and oh my god god it smells so freaking good it is called well it's got two scents it's got musk and vanilla and normally oh well i'm not a musk person okay i don't i don't like it but the vanilla one looks like it has literal vanilla extract in it and it smells so freaking good and then i actually do like this musk I know musk the word just sounds gross but i don't know it just smells so good so i'm gonna see if i can find the big bottles of this it just smells like luxury with like a little bit of vanilla like just sweet and if you mix them i wonder if it smells good if you mix them probably right why would they be sold together yep damn yeah this is the one you can get the dual ended one on sephora 
so cute such pretty packaging and just um it just smells so good okay it just smells so freaking good i'm just gonna put my trash down here under my table okay don't snitch okay so ugh, the perfume so another thing that i get from sephora if i want to buy this in store is my absolute favorite freaking candles aside from bath and body works now we're never going to stop fucking with bath and body works but my other favorite candles diffusers etc are what was that okay from nest you see this you see how big this is look look at my hands look how big this is now they sell these in store they sell the diffusers in store which are those things with the oil that you put sticks in and it puts out the scent they work i've had majors in his bathroom for a month and it's still going strong like it still smells so good but look at the packaging look at the packaging who 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 makes candles this pretty and that smell this good like I, I have one burning in front of me right now it's the birch wood and pine and then this one is holiday and it literally smells like christmas okay this smells like christmas so remember this one i got from sephora in store i also have a whole box over here that i bought from nest online because again holiday sale so got that one in the scent holiday it smells just like christmas okay that's the only way i know to describe it and that's just what it is next from sephora but ordered um again the scent line k ali if i'm saying that wrong sorry i don't know yeah this my friends i have discovered hair mist Remember how I just said I like my hair to smell good and I won't use a product if it doesn't smell good? This is a hair mist. This is a perfume that is safe for your hair. Like what's better? This scent is called White Flower, number 57. It just smells like rich. I don't know. It, it's okay. The scent is Gardenia, Jasmine, Orange, Flower tuberose tuberose infusion and tahitian vanilla she uses vanilla in a lot of her stuff and i think that's what makes it smell so good this is what the packaging looks like it's a fine mist i'll show you made in france it's safe for your hair it's for your hair it's a hair mist so your hair can smell like perfume too. How freaking cool is that? It smells so good. I highly recommend this. Yeah, it is. It is Huda. Yeah. Production in Dubai. Yeah. Amazing. 10 out of 10. Love it. Will buy again. You need it. If you like for your hair to smell good. Yeah. Okay. Uh, somebody asked me about my lip, like what lip masks and stuff that I use. These, these are the ones I was, uh, I commented back to you. This is what it is. This is the name. I'm not even going to try to say it. I'm not going to butcher it. Okay. Um, they come in this little, if you don't throw it, if you don't throw it anyway, I dropped it so hard it completely came unscrewed. Okay. They come in this cute little jar. Show you what it looks This is what it looks like. Very just smooth and creamy. And for the people who don't like to stick their fingers in things, or people who have nails and you don't want to carry bacteria, it comes with this little think it is so convenient i love this thing because you can dip it do your lips and then you can wash this thing you can clean it and it looks like this and it's rubber 
it's very soft and rubbery love it like best thing ever i have jacqueline hill cookies on right now so i'm not going to put it on but yeah and this one is vanilla okay sephora online tricked me because i really wanted the peppermint and when i clicked on the peppermint it switched me and said and like pretended like it wasn't available so i couldn't get the peppermint and i haven't been able to find it anywhere so whatever just gonna be mad about that for a while how much did i spend at this sephora sale i don't know if y'all wanted to know anyway next i I, I have so many palettes from ColourPop and stuff that have these colors, but I wanted the Tarte, the Tartlet Toasted Palette. I've always wanted this. I don't know why I never bought it, but here she is. Here she is. She's here. We bought her. Um, I wanted her. I got 20% off of my order. I'm pretty sure is what the sale was for this, for this whole order. It was like 20% off for VIB Rouge whatever that is oh, look at this just toast it just a fire oh my god yeah mm -hmm. yep and that's why that's why I bought her we're gonna do some looks with this next I got this is gonna be a long video so Next, I got my favorite, 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 favorite. Did you hear me? Favorite bronzer. NARS. Laguna bronzer. Look at this packaging, man. This just, just, packaging gets me. <sighs> just look at this. Just, 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 just look. And here's what it looks like. Fresh. She's so beautiful. Just stunning. Just stunning. And I think this one is the one that's got like a little bit of glow, which I love. Oh, another thing. Another lip product I was trying. I can't tell you guys for sure if I love it. I think I do. I use it once. This is the Sugar Advanced Therapy by Fresh. Um, I see a lot of people using these and I'm like, okay, well, it must be pretty good. I love a good lip treatment, especially in the winter. And it's freaking cold at my house, guys. It's so cold. Oh, and the packaging is not plastic. This is like metal. Like, it's screw on. And then it's like a regular chapstick lip treatment. But the packaging, like, it doesn't snap on. It's, you have to screw it. And then it doesn't come off. Convenient. Yeah. Do we like it? I'll let you know. And the last thing. Everybody has been buying this. Well, I said everybody, but I saw Samantha Joe buy it. And that's why I bought it. <laughs> because I'm easily influenced. So, you know what? She's a great influencer because she influences me to buy shit. This is the Charlotte Tilbury uh, Airbrush Flawless Foundation. Stays all day and night. And some other words. All right. I got it in 5.5 warm. Let's see what it looks like. I haven't opened this one. You can tell it's still got the sticker on it. Ooh, packaging's pretty. She is impressive. Look at her. She's stunning. So yeah, okay, got a little pump, love a pump. Uh, we'll test it out in a video, you know. though, The Birchwood Pine, this is a diffuser. Look how big this box is. This, um, this one I got from Sephora, like I said, you can buy these in the store. This, is, this smells like Christmas trees, okay? Like literally pine trees, like Christmas trees. That's, I'm burning the candle with this scent right now. I'm gonna show you what it looks like what the diffusers look like you they have different sizes too if you order online you don't have to get the the giant ones like i do there's the little sticks you take the sticks 
and you put them in this big boy right here this look at this packaging like look how pretty this is okay like look how big this is too it's just huge like i have this size of the holiday in major's bathroom man it's still going strong and like i said it's been like a month okay they also have wall diffusers i'm a big fan of plug-it-ins but it's hard for me to find any that i feel do what they need to be doing like i want the smell to be inviting the second you walk in the door so we're gonna try the one from nest this is what it looks like you just open this up here's the plug you just open this up stick it in there like a regular plug it in and then put the bottom well you know you get the idea and then it's just very clean and nice and neat okay this is a gift box that they're selling where you can get all three of their holiday scents which are holiday blue cypress and snow and birchwood pine i have all three because the blue cypress and snow smells like winter like just a winter scent to me then holiday just smells like christmas like cinnamon and then birchwood pine smells like exactly what it sounds like it smells like christmas trees so i got all three i got 25 percent off guys stop judging me i am not willing to skimp when it comes to the smell of my home or myself i will spend the extra money when i tell bobby how much that candle costs that i'm about to show you i'm not willing to be cheap about how my house smells but if you want to be bougie smelling but you you know you can't spend a whole lot of money it is the holidays i get it like i said i only bought all this stuff because i got 25 percent off but the the bigger candles are very expensive but if you buy the little ones even the little ornament size ones and put it in a bathroom and light it it will smell that whole bathroom and if you get these diffusers, like I'm gonna bet that these little diffusers, which cost much less, obviously, than the big, big one I just showed you, they're probably gonna smell up a good size space. So even if you just got this set and get their holiday sale, you'll be able to smell your house up, okay? The daddy of all candles. Actually, I would say this would be the mom because I think they have a bigger one. Don't think I won't get it this one is in the scent blue cypress and snow pretty blue packaging are you ready this is probably gonna be my thumbnail look at this fucking candle do you see how beautiful this is do you see do you see and the smell i bought a small i bought a small one in this scent to test i do i did that when i first started getting nest i saw jacqueline hill talk about it and i was like damn that looks really pretty they would look really pretty as christmas candles do they smell good and so i started i bought the little ones to test like literally the little teeny tiny ones and then the the next one up which is like the one i showed you the holiday one holiday scent then the next size up is this one and i'm pretty sure they even have an even bigger one than this this one is 70 dollars regular but but they have the holiday um sale right now they have a code if you go on their instagram they have a code for 25 percent off so if you do want this big candle you can get it 25 percent off right now and no i'm not getting paid to talk about this right now none of this is sponsored this is just my haul but you know what guys i think they need to sponsor me or give me affiliate links for this shit because i could be a great sponsor yeah this 
that one ain't coming out until the Christmas party, okay? This is the mommy of all candles. I'm 90% sure that there's an even bigger one. Let's move on to Ulta. Actually, before we move on to Ulta, okay, Buff Bunny had a sale going. <laughs> These are already sold out. Thank God I bought them the first day. They're legacy shorts. See, you just got the Buff Bunny logo. I love these kind of shorts to work out in or just to wear. But um, these are like freaking butter. Like they're so soft. I would say they're better than Lululemon. Sorry, Lulu. I uh, actually just bought some Lululemon and I have to return the shorts because they're literally two sizes too big. So and then here's the marble hoodie that I bought with it it's the white marble hoodie so cute I would never wear this with makeup or m I might be brave enough one day it's just it's just very nice comfortable I just really love it I think it's so pretty I wish I could have got the black one but they literally sold out so fast anyway that was buff bunny um I hope she restocks because I would buy more stuff now that I've tried it. But yeah, she's so Now this is Ulta. You guys told me that you wanted me to tell you the self tanner that I used in the winter. So I already used it once, but I got the big bottle of it. Here it is, Loving Tan. They also need to give me an affiliate link because I will sell the hell out of this for them. Um, Loving Tan, Two Hour Express. If you get it in the dark, to me, it's darker than the regular in the extra dark. And it's just a better... I, okay, I'm sure it's probably the same formula, obviously, besides the speed tanning part. But um, this is just better. And if you get it in dark, it is as dark or darker as the extra dark in the regular 8-hour tanner they have. I prefer this. This is a flawless formula. Like you will not have streaks it doesn't um fade patchy you know how most self tanners look patchy and flaky it doesn't do this um it looks very flawless very natural this is the best freaking tanner i've ever used but here's my key here's my secret sorry um, i showed you my secret the mitt um i haven't tried a loving tan mitt in a long time so i can't say that this one's better all I know is that I like this one because of the thumb. This is the Coco and Eve mitt. I is dirty because I just used it the other day. I love it because it allows you to seriously do what you need to do. And you just have better mobility because you have your thumb. And it's very soft. It just makes your tanner so flawless, so soft. It just looks so good. So that is my secret of my tan. One thing, one affiliate I am going to link in the bottom if you would like to support your favorite creator is, we talked about this, we talk about how I love their, I only use their primer, like I use their primer constantly, I talked about it in my last video, and their setting spray, Milani. I do have an affiliate link, so if you would like to support me by um, buying their sale right now, and you'll be supporting me. Okay, thanks. But seriously, this this is my favorite setting spray. I've told you this. I talk about it all the time. And you know they're no pore or no more pore primer that I showed you in my makeup video. Seriously, this is your chance to go get it. Next, you guys know that I love Jaclyn Hill. You know that I love her brand. I love her. But her brand is genuinely good. I don't support her brand just because I love her. If her product was shit, then I'd say it's shit and I'm not going to use it. It's not. Her Her brand is good. I need an affiliate link with her too. Okay? Or something. PR. Give, put me on the PR list, girl. I will tell them every time you send me something to go and buy it. Anyway, um, she highly recommends if you're going to get something to get this, especially in the winter. So I picked it up from Ulta. I told you guys that I prep my lips while I'm doing all my other makeup. I always prep my lips. 
this is the scrub and her um and her lip treatment so you obviously use the sugar scrub wipe it off and then put on the lip treatment and then while you're doing your makeup your lip treatment is going to make sure your lips are soft and smooth and flawless for when you apply your lipstick i also got another primer i like it's very similar to the milani it's just more expensive so that's why i say get the milani but um this is the nyx shine killer it's really good it does the same thing my wedding scent my favorite scent is ariana Gl ariana grande cloud okay that was my wedding scent because that is literally my favorite scent a lot of people say that that baccarat rouge that's going around the the famous like three or four hundred dollar it's over three hundred dollars for that perfume it smells they say that it smells like cloud okay but let me tell you something cloud has a sweeter smell to it baccarat smells like dirt I'm like I, I don't care i don't care if it's trendy i don't care trust me there are 300 dollars perfumes that i'm going to get but it's not baccarat it smells like dirt i don't care about the hype if you want something that smells like that but less dirty and more sweet and warm i would say get ariana cloud but now they have the cloud two wrong side 2.0 so i got it because i sprayed it on my skin spray stuff on your skin when you're testing a perfume do it on your skin because your skin is going to make it smell different i still smell the vanilla oh my god it smells so good okay but anyway this smells good on me I, a lot of people actually love it her perfumes are probably one of my favorite next brush i, I got this brush i already have one it, this is the type of brush I like to use because I have my extensions and I don't want to go in hard and grab my extensions. This is a very soft detangling brush. It doesn't snatch your hair or break your hair and it doesn't, it's not going to hook my weft and snatch it out, you know? So, these are really good. Wet brush. It's the Go Green Watermelon Seed Oil. This. One thing I don't, I will never do again is order from Ulta Online. This one came fine. This I'll just order straight from Truly next time. This is the Truly Moon Rocks. It's a whipped body scrub. I like to use a body scrub obviously before I tan. This is not the correct product. You wanna know why this is not the correct product, Ulta? Because I had to put it in a different jar that I already had due to you guys, Ulta, not packaging your products properly my glass products were sitting in the bottom of just an op just an empty box just sat on the bottom of the cardboard and then a piece of bubble wrap one little piece was just laid on top what the fuck was that supposed to do so therefore this product which was supposed to be the cbd unicorn fruit whipped body butter came broken there was shards of glass in it so i had to salvage what i could from like here up and put it in another bottle because this shit is like 25 dollars 23 25 dollars it's not cheap okay especially not the cbd one it was just busted because no nothing was secured nothing was secured nest let me tell you what my let me tell you how much nest cares about their packaging the fedex guy tripped on my step fumbled my box my my big ass candle flipped and it hit the ground and nothing broke you want to know why because everything was strategically secured in bubble wrap and tightly packed and protected how hard is that how hard is that anyway that's a very good body butter Jacqueline, we got more Jacqueline, okay? Let me get my free blanket out of the way. I spent enough to get a free blanket at Ulta. So, yep. Win. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. All right, these are all Jacqueline lip products. I got two lip liners. I got the lip liners in Hot Tea and Praline, and then I got the colors in Get Real, Crabby, and Be Brave. 
we will play with all of these in a video you guys know this but she has amazing lip products you know the drill you know you know how i feel next i also got her um brush and bronzer brush and bronzer duos were 50 percent off at ulta for black friday so got one of those and then oh again for my extensions you know i work out and you sweat from your head and i can't be washing my hair every single time i work out so i got this bumble and bumble post workout dry shampoo mist i got the little one because i wasn't sure if i was gonna like it but um we'll see haven't tried it yet because i left everything packaged for you for you guys so i could haul it for you I don't know. Okay, that's it. Now we gotta move on to Bath and Body Works because literally this video is gonna be a fucking hour long. Bath and Body. This one, this one's gonna be a long one too. Let's. Let me just tell you. I had to get this in a gift pack because they had two of these left, obviously because these are the best candles, and one of them was in a was gift wrapped. Well, I ain't giving it for no gift. It's mine the best bath and body works christmas scent this year i'm telling you my shogi's out here <sighs> the perfect christmas is the name and when i tell you it is literally the perfect christmas smell it is you can trust me uh it just smells like Christmas trees, cinnamon. What is, let me see what the notes are. Here we go. Fresh cut pine, cinnamon sugar, toasted marshmallow. Absolutely all of that. Yep, it's all of that. It smells mostly like fresh cut trees and like cinnamon sugar for sure. Next, we have Bitch, you know, you know the scent that we have to get every year. Fresh fucking balsam. Ugh, there, nothing beats this scent, okay? And look at the packaging on this one. This is just the cutest shit ever, okay? Just the cutest shit ever. Whoa, what happened to the lighting? Oh, there we go. Ugh, just... It's everything you want. It's everything I want my guests to be engulfed by and welcomed by when they come to my home. I'm really into peppermint mocha, drinks, things like that. I don't know how I'm gonna like having it as a smell in my home, but I did get crushed candy cane. So we're gonna see. It smells, it smells like candy cane. It doesn't smell like straight peppermint. It smells sweet. It smells like a candy cane. So I'm thinking I might like that because it's more sweet than peppermint. And I really like sweet smells. Then obviously I got all of the candles that I have. I pretty much got them in plug it in. So yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna list to you all the plug it ins <laughs> since I got. We did get a soap. I got two soaps actually. Winterberry ice and peach berry snowy something or other. Yeah. Oh, I got this for my Jeep. Isn't this so cute? Yeah. Look at it. Yeah, it has green thing on it. And then I got this little plug it in gnome. Had I got him for Major, but Major didn't want him. He wanted Santa. So I gave Major Santa and I kept that one. Next we have under the Christmas tree. Look at the packaging. So good. Great packaging. This one smells more fir, balsam, juniper berries, vanilla eggnog, sage leaves. I can smell the sage leaves. This just smells more pine. Whereas fresh balsam is more Christmas tree sweet. That is pretty much it. Other than if my leopard slippers, but I got this from Amazon. <laughs> okay.
that is it this video was hella long but um you want to get in the frame yeah scoot over there you go so yeah daddy got a bunch of strawberry pound cake yeah. <laughs> anyway that's the end of the haul these are the best christmas scents in my opinion um so if you like sweet and Christmassy smells then get those highly recommend it yes so thank you guys so much for watching I hope that you enjoyed this haul are we ready to vlog every day Shuggy? yeah yeah we're gonna be doing all kind of shit all through December thank you so much for watching and um should I, I can't say stay creepy because it's not just paranormal anymore what am I gonna say now Bye. Bye.